Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to do the DIY $10 oil pressure sensor relocation kit. So what you're going to need is this grease gun hose from Home Depot, this fitting from Home Depot, and you'll need the adapter to fit an NPT uh, screw, and then you're going to need the Teflon tape. So let's get this started. So the first thing you're going to need to do is remove this grease gun adapter off the hose. So once you have that off, you can go ahead and start putting together the kit. You're not going to need this anymore. Get the Teflon tape and just wrap the threads a little bit. So now that you have both sides wrapped in Teflon tape, go ahead and get your brass pipe fitting. Get your brass pipe fitting and then just screw it on to the, one of the ends. So now that I've got the brass fitting on here, we can go to the car and start installing this kit. So this is a 2013 WRX and what you're going to need to do is remove the alternator. So once you got your alternator out, just put it on the ground. So from here, just remove the oil pressure connector, and then just remove the oil pressure sensor. So once you have the oil pressure sensor off, just go ahead and remove the adapter. So there we have it, that's the factory adapter. So then, the next thing you're going to want to do is get your adapter that you just bought that has the NPT threading. I'm going to go ahead and put it back on. Alright, so once that's on, you can go ahead and get your hose and just thread it down. So there we have it, the hose is now installed. So the next thing you're going to need to do is just get your oil pressure sensor and just attach it to this hose. So there we go, that's with the oil pressure sensor on and now what you're going to need to do is just reinstall the alternator and you're done. So there we have it. That's the DIY $10 oil pressure relocation kit. So just mount it however you want and that's about it. Alright, thanks for watching.